so I just want to talk about these excess big dot sights for a little bit. Um, I've had them on the gun for about a year now, and I absolutely love them. Uh, I mean, pretty much, it's pretty simple. You put that big old dot on the target and press the trigger, and there you go. I've shot a lot of different types of sights, but <clears throat> as far as uh, like getting on target real quick, uh, you can see that V down in there, right? Um, and you just naturally end up putting that big, like I, I call it a golf ball. Um, you end up putting that golf ball like right in the middle of that valley, just naturally. Uh, where like standard sights typically will, um, you know, it takes a little bit longer because you gotta like process all the angles, 90 degrees and stuff like that. Um, so uh, even though you don't, you're not really thinking about it, you're just trying to line it up, your brain is calculating, do, 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 trying to get all that stuff lined up. Where this, you just put the golf ball on the target. All right, so would I recommend the sights? Absolutely, uh, especially if you're gonna be carrying the gun as like a, a concealed carry gun. Um, for sure, definitely uh, definitely the way to go as far as sights. Um, I'm not ever switching back, that's for sure. Uh, another thing is uh, not only do you have that big golf ball, you know, um, to get on target real quick, uh, but you've got a little piece of tritium in there. Uh, let, let me see if I can show you. So I don't know if you guys can see it too good, but uh, inside the middle of that uh, white ring is a little piece of tritium. So you uh, can see it at night, which is pretty awesome. Um, they make some where this little white dash on the rear sight has a little piece of tritium. Um, I don't think they make it for the m and series, but I know they do on the Glock. So yeah, definitely if, uh, if you're going to be carrying your gun all the time, I recommend getting those excess big dot sights. Um, they even have the tritium in it, so you can see it in the dark. Hell yeah, uh, because, you know, <clears throat> most of the time when we're at the range, it's uh, daylight, you know, and uh, guess what? You're not always going to be using your gun in the daylight. So, you know, take that into consideration. And uh, I hope you guys found this video useful. See you guys later. Oh,